Man, 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 man. Let me tell y'all this. This is a story time. Let me tell y'all the story about how I went to the wrong damn airport. I sure did, bro. Never happened a day in my life, but it happened. And your boy was sick. So, this happened. Was, when was this? This was like in 2022. 2022. Might have been 2021. 2022. I think it was... It might have been, I think it was 2022. So, so one day I was sitting down. I was like, man, I visit some of my friends, my cousins. You know what I'm saying? They up in Washington, D.C. So I was like, boom, I'm going to book me a ticket. You know what I'm saying? I found me a nice little cheap ticket. I think I was on, I might have been on, I don't know what airline it was. It might have been Delta. Might have been, I don't remember. But either way, I booked me, you know, a ticket. Nice little price to go up to Washington, D.C. for a weekend. It was Thursday through Sunday. So, you know, I went up to Washington, D.C., you know, met up with my boys. We had a good time. We went to what was the, I think it was a place called Stanley's. We went to Stanley's. They gave us like a, you go you get a drink at Stanley's, bro. They give you a, 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 a cup of juice and they give you like a, a, a cup of a shot to the side. You could just pour it and, and mix it how you want. I was like, damn, I ain't never had this treatment before. This is good bang for your buck. So I like Stanley. So, you know, we went to Stanley's, you know what I'm saying? And we went to another spot. It was like, I think it was around, it was around Christmas too because we went to like this Christmas sweater party. That was pretty cool. We went to like a R&B joint. That was straight. You know, I had a, 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 a hotel in the city, you know what I'm saying? So I pulled in that mug. You know, it was dope Went to a little brunch spot by myself a couple of times Went, walked around downtown a little bit So I was vibing, yo Like I was having a good time in D.C. Like it was a good time You know what I'm saying? Like we went to a couple of spots So it was dope I, I like D.C. I enjoyed it And, you know, everything was good Weather wasn't too bad It was kind of chilly But it wasn't too bad at the time It was, I think it was December Or the end of November But either way it was a good time. I'm enjoying it. I'm loving it. So the day that I was supposed to leave, right? I'm packing my bags in the hotel. Got my carry-on right. Got my bags. You know, I'm getting right. Boom, boom, boom. I get to the lobby of the hotel. I call the Uber. You know, call the Uber. You know, they came quick. Three minutes. Bang. I said, okay, they quick around here. They quick around here. I get to the, I get to the um airport at a good time you know you want to get to the airport about two hours in advance you know line kind of long so i'm like okay well i'm here early i'm cool i could breeze i could chill i got my beats headphones on right i got my beats on listening probably larry june big sean somebody like that you know you know me cool chill vibes right you know i'm getting to the front of the line you know what i'm saying i'm like okay I'm at TSA, so you know when you get to TSA, you pull out your ID, you pull out your phone, they scan it for you, boom. So I walked up, had my ID out, and had my phone out, had all that out. Put the phone on the thing, they ain't making no noise. Dude was like, yeah, let me let me see, let me see your phone. And they made the noise, it's like, dee, 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 and it's wrong. I was like, what's going on? And dude was like, yeah, something's going on here. Let me see your, your um, your itinerary and things like that. I was like, all right, bet. I look, he look, I look, when I look, I was like, huh. So I gave him the phone, when he looked, he was like, yeah, bro, um, you at the wrong airport. You supposed to be at Dulles. I said, the wrong airport? I flew, in, I flew into Ronald Reagan. I ain't flew into no Dulles. What you mean I'm at the wrong airport? He was like, yeah, so look like you flew into Ronald Reagan, but, your flight leaving is actually in Dulles. I was like, I ain't even know DC have two airports. Like, well, Dulles? I don't know nothing about no Dulles. So, at this point, I'm all confused. The line long as hell. People looking at me like, what is this dude doing? So I had to go all the way. Actually, I didn't even have to go all the way. They escorted me out because they opened the ropes up and let me go through instead of having to go through the little zigzag. Man, I was so embarrassed. So now I'm like, bruh, I'm really at the wrong airport. Now, at this time, I'm thinking I might miss my flight because I done spent almost an hour in the airport. Got probably like another hour to my plane leave. And now I got to call another uber to get me to dulles that's like another 45 to an hour out so i'm like bro this shit really about to happen dog this shit i'm really about to miss my flight so i'm running dog i'm running and calling the uber at the same time doom 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 so uber get ping 
I see the Uber moving slow. I'm like, yo, what what going on, dog? Uber going slow. He going around the whole. I don't know if y'all know how Ronald Reagan set up, but this dude going around. I'm like, bro, this is not the time. But yo, for you to be playing around with me, bro. I text that man. I said, like, look. Cause you know on the Uber app you can text me. I'm like, look, I missed my flight. I need to get to Dulles. My flight is actually in Dulles, not in Ronald Reagan. I need to get up. I need to go quite fast. Like, so he pulled when he pulled up, he was kind of urgent. When he got out of the car, got my stuff in, we got in, boom, he rolling through the lights like zoom, 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 zoom. I'm in that bit. I think the car about to shut down, bro. Like, I'm in the back. And you ever be in the back and you just smell like fumes? I'm smelling gasoline. It smell like gasoline and rich crackers, bro. I'm like, what kind of Uber am I in? I need to get to Dulles. And I need to get to Dulles safe. This man kind of like on the side of the road going in and out like he's sleepy. Like it's early in the morning too. Like I was like, bro, I really hope when I get to Dulles, the line isn't long. Like... I need to be able to get in and out. I ain't never even heard of Dulles before. I'm like, I felt like I was getting car sick and shit. Like, I was just, it was, it's crazy. So I'm still in the car. He's like, yeah, look like we're going to get there at a reasonable time. I think you're still going to make your flight. I'm like, man, bro, this don't even seem right. Like, this never happened to me before. So we pulling up to the airport. Boom. I get out. We get the, I get the bags. I look around. I'm like, okay, it's not that many people. It's not that many people in here. Okay, cool. So I'm looking. I got about 20 minutes till my flight board. And I'm like, I'm hoping I can get through TSA quick, boy. Because a boy ain't got TSA pre-check. Ain't got clear. I ain't got none of that. I got regular old TSA general. Like, I ain't got no pre-check. Pre-check take too long to sign up for. You got to go back to the airport and all that. Like, I ain't got time for that. So one day I'm going to have it, but I don't. I didn't have it and still don't have it now. So I'm going through the airport. It's a breeze so far. I get to TSA. They ain't make your boy take your shoes off. I'm like, boom, I can just get through here. Got the bag. Boom, boom, boom. Next thing you know, bag come back. Beep, 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 beep. I'm like, come on. Why y'all got to check my bag? I ain't had to check my bag at Ronald. <sighs> So basically, they being real good at their job. That's what they doing. They 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 got my bag. So in my bag, I had a tripod, and you know the tripod look pointy, right? Tripod look pointy. So they was like, just want to see what this item is. At this moment, it's about ten minutes left to my flight board. I still got to get to the goddamn terminal. I was like, yeah, just a tripod, you know what I'm saying? He's like, all right, cool, cool, cool. So I got all my stuff packed back up, got my bag, got to my terminal. Five minutes left before boarding. That's the closest I ever made it to getting on my flight. And boy, I tell you, I ain't never felt that stress a day in my life. By the grace of God, I made it. I made on my flight. As soon as I sat down, I said, <sighs> I learned my lesson though. From this day forward, I learned my lesson. Check and see what airport you flying in and what airport you flying out of. I automatically thought since I was flying in the Ronald Reagan, I was leaving out of Ronald Reagan. I didn't know the thing. Because at the time when I was booking, I was booking for good times to leave. I wasn't looking at I think, I think Dulles is IAD or something like that. I wasn't looking at all that. I was looking at the times. I was like, oh, this is a good time to leave. I'm thinking that since I already picked my uh, arriving flight to go to Ronald Reagan, I thought automatically they would show me Ronald Reagan departures. They ain't did that shit. Your boy, I... It, I Rookie mistakes, man. Rookie mistakes. So, hey, y'all, make sure y'all check y'all damn itinerary because don't pull a me. Don't, don't, don't pull a me and be stressed and be embarrassed because you got to go up there and check in and they can't check your thing. You got to turn all the way around. You got don't be me, man. Like, <laughs> but I learned my lesson ever since then. Never did it again. I hope none of y'all never did that. If you're flying to D.C., there's two airports, Ronald Reagan and Dulles. Like I said, I ain't never heard of no Dulles. I don't even know if I'm saying it right. It look like Dulé. That's what it look like to me. I think it's Dulles. <laughs> but 
I appreciate y'all for watching this video and listening to this story time, man. I just I just thought it would be a cool story to tell because God dang, man. Ain't, ain't, I never would have thought in a million years, but appreciate y'all for watching. I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace.